hello guys you're welcome back once again to my channel and on today's video i'm actually going to be showing you how to import the avive profile nft that we just meted here into your metamask account and of course a lot of persons have been having issues they don't know how to import this nft into their metamask account and i'm going to be showing you a practical way that you can do that very easy and simple now if i come to my of course you can see on my wallet here I'm already on my Arbitrum network. Of course, you can see it. I'm already on Arbitrum network. And then if I go over to my NFT session here, you can see that it's already imported into my MetaMask. Of course, you can see my own Avive profile NFT method is already imported into my account here. So I'm also going to be showing you how you can import yours very easy and simple. So to get started, I'm actually using my mobile extension here, my MetaMask mobile extension. I actually tried this out on my MetaMask mobile application, but it wasn't actually working. And when I did it on my web extension here, of course, it works very, very fine. So I can also advise you maybe perhaps if you try using the mobile app to import yours, it didn't work, just use your mobile extension and it's actually going to work and how do you get the mobile extension it's very easy just go to any browser and search for kiwi browser or Macy's browser these two browsers support mobile extension so once you get these browsers any of them downloaded to your phone under the kiwi browser and of course i'm actually using the kiwi browser you can see it right here i'm using the kiwi browser so any of them supports mobile extension so once you download either the macy's browser or the kiwi browser then go to the search session and search for metamax extension and you are just going to download it so once you have downloaded it on your phone the next thing you need to do let me just go out entirely so that i will show you how to get started immediately so of course once i exit this and uh, let me just go back so you can see this is my kiwi browser i have it here on my phone so what i will do is to go ahead open this my kiwi browser and once it's open like this of course you can see is my avive profile connected so the next thing i need to do is to come to this three dot here this three dot here this hamburger sign here and click on it so once you click on it of course i'm scrolled down you can see the extension that i have on this particular browser here you can see i have fire extension of course you can see i have threads layer extension but what you are looking for is the metamask extension so you just go ahead click on this metamask extension and it's actually going to load up and then once you load up it requires you to log in of course you are going to input your metamask password so that you can be able to log in and then you come here and click on unlock so i'm going to do that right away here so once i'm done imputing my password i'll just go ahead click on open in this particular place here and of course it's actually logging me in of course you can see i have been able to log in back to my account and once you log in here of course you can see you need to go back to your arbitrum mainnet so i'm already on arbitrum network here. if you are not on arbitrum network you just have to click on this place and you select the arbitrum network here so you see mine is already selected and once you select the arbitrum network of course it will be on the token side then you just need to come to where you have nft click on nft and once you click on nft here yours you will not see anything here because you have not actually imported yours so yours will not be here so all you just need to do you just click on import nft here you can see import nft here yours might not be showing here yours might just be showing somewhere in the middle here you just click on that import nft and once you click on import nft let me show you again once i click on this import nft there are two things you'll be needing here to successfully import your nft one is the avad profile contract address you are going to paste it here and i'm going to leave the avad profile contract address in the description of this video and i'll also pin it in the comment section so that you can easily get it or better still if you are on our whatsapp group on our telegram channel i'm still going to drop it here so that you can get it anywhere that is more convenient for you just copy it come to this address here and paste it here 
this is where the avive profile contract address you are going to paste it here so you get it either in our whatsapp group in our telegram channel or better still in the description of this video just copy it like that come here paste it then once you paste it the second stuff we need is here where we have token id so the token id is the number of that your nft for instance let me go back again let me close this and if i open my own um nft here which i have imported if i open it of course you can see here you have a number there is a number showing here now after my um, nickname there is a number showing here so that is the id number that you will need so you have to get this number copy it and once you copy it you can go to copy it you can go back and log in back to your avive account once you log into your avive account you will see your nft here so you can you will also see this number copy it down so once you copy it down then you are good to go so all you just need next is to come back to the import session where we are once you come back here you paste the avive profile contracts here then the id token id which is the number i just show you now your nft profile number you paste it here once you have done these two things then the next thing is you come to this place and click on import so for instance let me copy it and show you so i will come here and paste the avive nft profile here so once i paste it then i will come down again to this particular place and then paste my profile nft number so once i click on it i'm going to paste the nft number here so once that is done of course you can see that this add button is now much active so i'm just going to go ahead you go ahead and click on this add button and this uh, particular nft will be imported successfully into your account i'm not going to do this because i have already imported mine but this is basically how you will go about it and yours will be imported and then you will come to this place and see so that anytime you log into your metamask account go to your arbitrum network because that is the network we use in making it so once you switch over to the nft session of course you are going to see your nft below this place here so this is basically how you can import your profile nft on your metamask accounts thank you so much for watching this video remember if you are yet to subscribe to this channel please go ahead subscribe to this channel like this video share this video and very much important turn on the bell notification icon so that whenever i drop an awesome update you are not going to miss out of it thank you once again see you in my next video and bye for now